Tonight, a community in Arizona is reeling from a terrible tragedy just days before Christmas. Five children killed in a fire, and tonight investigators are still trying to figure out what sparked the flames. 12 News journalist Gabriela Becerra is live in Bullhead City tonight with the latest information. And Gabby, this is just an unthinkable situation. What have you learned from investigators? Well, Kribe, we've learned that a father was out Christmas shopping when he came home to an unimaginable tragedy. Now a memorial is growing along his fence as the community mourns five kids lost in that fire. It's unfathomable. I mean, gosh, it, it so quickly happened, you know, one second and then your whole life is over. A Bullhead City neighborhood is grieving the loss of five children between the ages of two and 13 years old. Four of the children were siblings who lived at the home and the fifth child was a visiting relative. Five children, that's got to be hard right now to lose. <laughs> Police say a fire started in the downstairs foyer of a duplex Saturday evening near Ramar and Hancock Roads. The flames and smoke spread up the stairs to a bedroom where all of the kids were found. Yep, still coming out the backside. Police say it would have been near impossible for them to escape. It was so heart-wrenching brought tears to my eyes just hearing it. Neighbors tried to put out the fire themselves using nearby hoses and using a ladder to get to the second floor. But one neighbor tells me they didn't know the kids were inside. And it's really hard to like come out of the home every day and know what happened here. No adults were home. The father told police he had been out Christmas shopping. On Christmas Day, those families aren't going to be able to sit there and open up presents with those children right now. They're going to have to be celebrating a memorial instead. Family, friends, and neighbors have stopped by the home. When I heard that they were allowing you to come through and put stuff, I told him I'm going to go grab some teddy bears. Leaving items and saying a quick prayer for the lives lost too soon. It's just, it's sad. It's just really sad. It's heartbreaking knowing that these kids could have been someone another kid looked up to or played with and shared lots of memories with. Police say that investigators collected evidence from inside the home because the victims are related to a member of the Bullhead City Fire Department. They have brought in assistance from Lake Havasu City Fire Department and ATF to investigate this case. Reporting live in Bullhead City, Gabriela Becerra, 12 News. Well, all right, Gabby, we appreciate that live report up there. Well, as we kick off.